Because I'm going to show it to you anyway, right? All right, so now I'm going to model for you, class. How to subtract fractions with um, unlike denominators using a visual model. So my first fraction is 3 fourths. So I'm going to draw a rectangle. And then I'm going to put lines in it going up and down, which is vertical. And I'm going to break it up based off the denominator, which is 4. So I'm going to create four equal parts. One, two, three, four. All right. And I'm going to pick a different color and I'm going to shade in three. Remember I told you it doesn't have to be perfect. I'm going to shade in three. One, two, and three. Then I'm going to put a subtraction sign in the middle. And I'm going to draw another rectangle. And this one I'm going to break into three parts because my denominator is three. But I'm going to use horizontal lines, which goes from left to right. So one, two, three. And I'm going to shade in one part to show one third. I love how people in the room are doing working it out on paper and pencil. I see you, Alice. Give Alice a point. Brooklyn, give yourself a point. Give Mazaya a point. Give Samaria a point. Give Andrew a point. And Aaliyah, give everybody in class a point. Because they're working it out. They're doing what I'm doing on paper. All right, so now I need to make, step three says, make the first shape look like the second shape. So that means I'm going to put two lines going horizontal okay and then also part of step three i have to make the second shape look like the first shape so i'm gonna make three lines going vertical okay okay now the way to subtract is to count the total number that you're going to subtract in model one. One, two, three, four, and subtract them. I mean, count the total you're going to subtract in model two and subtract them from model number one. So I counted four that I need to subtract from model number two. So I'm going to take four away from model number one. One, two, three, four. Now I'm going to figure out what my answer is. So I'm going to draw a fraction bar and I'm going to count the total number of parts. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So 12 is my new denominator. And then the number of color in parts that don't have an X on them is my numerator. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So my answer is 5 twelfths. Now, the other part of it is, if you want to, you can actually sit here and create the fractions of both. So this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to create the fraction for both and show them. So how many total parts is in the first shape? 4, 8, 12. Then how many total parts in the second? 4, 8. 12, so my denominators are correct. So the way I split my or set up my shapes is correct. So now I'm going to count the total number of shaded parts, 3, 6, 9. And then over here I have 1, 2, 3, 4. And then I'm going to subtract. 9 subtract 4 is 5. Denominator is 12. So I just showed you two ways to interpret your model to get your final answer. I showed you two ways to interpret the model to get your final answer when you subtract fractions using a visual model um, with unlike denominators.